What is going on, you guys? Andrew Roboto here, and welcome back to Five Nights at Warriors 3 Custom Room Edition, where we will be taking on part 6 of the custom night mode in the storage room. And for this room, Mario and Luigi are active, so I've set them to their levels right there, and I've also set the camera power to the level. So without further ado, we will take on part 6 of the custom night mode in the storage and see what has to offer for us. That was an unsettling music it's just playing. Hey, Jordan is going to take over the call for tonight. You and him seem to get along well. Alright, uh, good night. Dude, you there? Awesome, awesome. Alright, so you're telling me you hide in the old storage room. Okay, well, there's a neat tool in that room that allows you to control the fire alarms. You can use a weak alarm, medium alarm, or strong alarm. The strong alarm is very loud and can scare any ghosts away. The medium one is a bit less loud. It can still scare a ghost. And the weak one is not very strong. It might startle anyone in the room that you're looking at. Oh yeah, they can only be used if you're looking at someone in the cameras. Oh, and... If someone should enter your room, use their emergency alarm in there. It should scare them away. Each alarm does need to cool down after one use. So be careful. Alright? Be safe in there. Okay, so we have a set of fire alarms right here. Red is weak, yellow is medium, green is strong. And then we have an emergency alarm to use right here if someone comes in the room. Huh. Interesting. Got it. Mario's music box is rather loud in this room. <laughs> okay. And since the garage and the attic are the closest, I mean the garage and the second bathroom are, I'm gonna I'm gonna use the green I'm gonna use the strong alarm for when one of them come in. Then we have an emergency button right there, so that's pretty cool. Okay, so far I haven't seen Mario or Luigi yet. So far I haven't. That's really interesting. Oh, Mario's jingle means he's moving. Okay, let me check the camera. See then. I haven't seen him in the emergency room. I mean in the stores room, my bad. <laughs> what I meant to say is that I haven't had to use the emergency alarm. Or any alarm at all. Okay. Let me see what happens if I press the emergency. Oh, the emergency just makes a shocking sound. Okay. And then let me see. What, I'm going to press the weak alarm and see what happens. Hold on a minute. I got to let the camera recharge because this thing goes down like mildly, like wildly fast. Okay, let's see what's next. Yep, camera just died. <laughs> I forgot about that. So far I haven't seen Mario or Luigi yet. I don't know why I haven't. Okay. Okay, the alarms can only work in a camera if Mario or Luigi are in, but so far they haven't showed up. I didn't even put them on level zero, so I don't know why they haven't shown up yet. This is a really peculiar night to do.
That's really peculiar. That is really peculiar how I haven't seen Mario or Luigi appear in a storage room. I'm checking, so I don't know what's going on. It's probably because I'm, ch I'm assuming that I'm checking the cameras and they're not coming. That's why. I mean, I didn't set them on zero. I put them on, like, level five before I did this video, so... And I'm hearing Mario's jingle for some weird reason. <laughs> Let's see. That's really peculiar. Speak of the devil, it's already 5 a.m. And I have not seen any trace of Mario or Luigi. That's really peculiar. I don't know. Maybe if I check the cameras, then... Prob I'm assuming this room is a freebie, meaning if I constantly check the cameras, the characters won't show up. I mean, that's really weird. Usually, like, a character will show up on the camera the second the night starts, after I set them to their levels. But that's really weird. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that's the storage room for you. <laughs> well, ladies and gentlemen, here is the storage room with absolutely nothing going on in here. And Mario and Luigi have not shown up yet. So, there you have it, folks. We've hit... We have made it to 6 a.m., so there you have it. Like I said, here is the storage room with nobody in it, nobody coming in it. So, this is definitely the most infamous room in the game I've ever played. <laughs> Anyways, and while we're on the topic of rooms, I'm going to take on the fourth living room. As okay, let's see what the next room is. So the next room we have to take on is the fourth living room, and hopefully we will have characters come in the room and not get lucky by not having them show up at all. Because, I mean, look right here. Look at how I clearly set Mario and Luigi to level 5. I clearly set them to their levels, and they never showed up in the room. That's really weird. Okay, anyway, so so for the fourth living room, I'm going to take on the fourth living room since I have enough time left to record. Um, for the fourth living room, we got Wario, Yoshi, Mario, Donkey Kong, and Demon Warrior that are active. So I'm going to go set them to their levels. I'll keep Mario on level five since he's already set there. Okay, let me check again. I get, sorry, I gotta double check again to see who the characters we're dealing with are. Okay, Wario, Yoshi, Mario, Donkey Kong, Demon Wario. Okay. And then Donkey Kong and Demon Wario, we can only set the level 1 because they're hallucinations. And then the others, I set the level 5 since they're more active on there. Okay, so without further ado, we will take on part 6 of the custom night mode in the 4th living room as well and see what it has to offer for us. Hopefully it will offer something better for us, instead of the, rather than the storage room. <laughs> hey, Jordan is going to take over the... Ah, Donkey Kong! You and him seem to get along well. Alright, uh, good night. Hey, what's going on, man? You doing all right? Cool, cool. What's that? The living room? Huh, well, that room is, um, pretty open, right? It's also pretty easy to see in there. Well, if anyone comes in from the right, just don't look at them. Look to the opposite side, and maybe they'll leave. Ah, Donkey Kong! If someone happens to be right in front of you, maybe cover your eyes with your hands as eye contact makes them more angry in that room. You also have the ability to turn off cameras, so if you see something... Okay, strange, shut down cameras and we have a hand right there. Alright? Don't worry, they'll turn back on shortly. Now that room has a TV in it, correct? Yes, that's correct. Well, I would be careful. Jack was saying something about, I don't know, the TV making him feel very strange when he was near it, and making him see things. Not sure what he means. I would be careful if I were you. Alright, be safe, man. Okay, so... Oh, Donkey Kong's here. So if Donkey Kong comes in, then we have to put the camera up. Because he's a hallucination. 
Ah! Mass space to stop Demon Wario. Okay, so Demon Wario and Donkey Kong have the same mechanics. Donkey Kong, you have to put the camera up if you see him, and then Demon, well, Demon Wario has the same mechanic as the game where you have to mash the space bar to get rid of him. For Donkey Kong, we have to put the camera up because he's a hallucination. And the third bedroom, his mechanic is different. We have to open our eyes again. And I'm assuming Mario is going to be the or Mario is going to be the one coming from the TV because he tends to come from TVs in some Final Fantasy Warriors games. And and we and we have a, and we can shut down the cameras, which we have that mechanic. Oh, Mario's on the camera. Okay. Okay, so Mario's actually going to appear on the cameras and not on the TV. And I think if he, if he looks up at me, then I have to shut down the cameras, because his head is kind of down. Which means he's not ready to attack until his head is up. Which I, yeah. I'm going to, I got to go check on Mario on the camera, just so, um... Just so to see if he has his head up or not. Because if he has his head up, then that's a bad thing. Oh, I got to stop Demon Wario. There you go. Space to stop Demon Wario. And then I don't know how we're going to deal with Wario and Yoshi. Oh, Mario's here. I think I gotta shut down the cameras. Okay, is running a bad thing because I hear running? Ah! Okay, how do I deal with Mario? I'm shutting down the cameras, and he's still in his second stage, where he stares at you. And I gotta not look at the TV, too, because I think Wario or Yoshi's gonna come for me or something. Okay, I'm constantly shutting down the cameras. I don't know what's happening with Mario. I'm shutting down the cameras, and he's not doing anything. Does he have to, like, move out a little bit just to do it? I don't know. Oh, I gotta stop Demon Wario. Okay, finally the fourth living room has something happening instead of the storage room. Because I don't know what happened in the storage room, but that was just a pure coincidence. Oh, Donkey Kong's here. Ah! Oh, come on, Donkey Kong. Ugh. I was just, I was shutting down the camera, and I didn't realize Donkey Kong was coming, and then, he, and then I couldn't react in time, and he jump scared me. <sighs> God damn it, Donkey Kong. I'm trying to deal with Mario, and it makes it less helpful when you come in. Ugh. And Donkey Kong has the same jump scare as he does in Final Fantasy Warriors 3, where he just disables your mechanics. And I'm assuming Demon Wario is gonna hold, gonna disable the mechanics if I don't um if I don't mash the space button. Oh, I gotta stop Demon Wario. There you go. Ugh. Ah, Donkey Kong's here. Oh, come on, Donkey Kong. God, why can't you... Why can't I put up the camera right when you're jump-scaring me? That's so messed up. God, I hate Donkey Kong in this game because he... Because he disables your mechanics. So far, I haven't died yet, so that's a good thing. Alright, we've beaten... Part 6 of the custom night mode in the living, 4th living room as well in this video. 
That was a little stressful because of Donkey Kong, but we beat it nonetheless. So anyways, let's see what room we have next to do. Okay, the next room we have to do is the closet. And for the closet, um, it's got the same characters active as in Trapped Within, which is Wario, Wario, Waluigi, and Mario. Which we will take on the closet in part 7 of the Customized Mode, which will be in the next video. So I will end my video here. Thank you for watching, everybody. Please hit the like button, also comment and subscribe. I appreciate all the support you have given me. Hit the bell to receive all notifications of upcoming videos on my channel. And I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.